What is up? This is your LA in a minute, and I'm here in Griffith Park, and this is a hawk. I'm not an ornithologist, so I do not know much about them, but I know that they are important in Los Angeles, and I want to find out, so let's get into it. Hawks are included in a group of birds called raptors. They're carnivorous birds of prey that include hawks, eagles, vultures, and even owls. Hawks are the top predators of the sky in Los Angeles and beyond, and they're extremely important to the environment and ecosystem of Los Angeles. It's important to note that raptors, and hawks in particular, have been called ecological barometers. It means they help gauge how healthy a habitat is. They're extremely sensitive to environmental changes, so if hawks start dying off, look out humans. On a day-to-day -day basis, hawks are important because they eat insects, they eat rodents, and they eat dead carcasses, which may be diseased, which means they help keep these diseases at bay and prevent them from spreading. That's good news for us in LA because hawks have adapted seamlessly to our urban and suburban environments here in Los Angeles. Written records of hawks in Los Angeles date back to at least the early 1800s. And while early Los Angeles was mostly grasslands and chaparral, the eastern end of the Santa Monica Mountains, now known as Griffith Park, would have been a suitable nesting habitat for these birds, which are considered native to Los Angeles. The most common raptor in Los Angeles is called the Cooper's Hawk. It's a bird that's very good at utilizing urban spaces. They feed on small birds, so they can find prey pretty much anywhere, especially far away from wilderness, and their population is exploding due to the lack of natural predators in this area. Now, the ones we see most often are called the red-tailed hawks. You can see those flying over when you're in your car, circling above treetops, or perched on traffic lights and poles. They usually hover and hover and prey on rodents, and they coexist well with humans, so it's not uncommon to find them right near your house. The third most common type of hawk in Los Angeles is called the red-shouldered hawk. They're typically found near bodies of water, which in Los Angeles means near the Arroyo Seco, Beverly Glen, and Studio City. These red-shouldered hawks are pretty identifiable, not just because they always have this look on their beak, but because they're the most noisy of all the hawks. They have a distinct kia call, and they often whistle, so they're heard before they're spotted. Now again, I'm not an ornithologist, but Friends of Griffith Park has this thing called the LA Raptor Study, which engages volunteers all across Los Angeles to monitor raptor nests, their behavior, and how they're adapting to the urban environment. You can check it out online, or you can even volunteer if you wish. In short, not only are hawks beautiful, but they're integral to the ecosystem in Los Angeles. And if you keep an eye out, you can probably spot some hawks flying near you. All right, LA, it's been a minute.